2023, we are going to be talking to Mark Martinez, a once former college baseball player with the highest hopes of going number one overall in the MLB draft, only to find love in college and to get a girl pregnant. So we're going to fast forward over to Mark right now. So I was a baseball player at Warner University. Um, I had the greatest two seasons of my life. Um, as you know, Warner University is down in Bassman mm -hmm. Park, Florida. Um, one of my, after one of my games, though, I went to a bar with my teammates, you know, after, after a big win. I went four for four that night, no big deal. Uh, and I ended up finding the love of my life right here, Corey. And uh, we did it for six months, and we uh, are now having a baby. It was a little <laughs> unexpected, and I decided to put my baseball career on hold. Um, I'm happy that you chose to take care of me and um, our new family. It was unexpected, um, but hopefully after um, we have our baby that he'll be able to pursue his career in the MLB and hopefully have uh, create a better life for me and my family. I had uh, a couple teams looking at me and uh, I just hope and pray that after the year or two off that they're still willing and, you know, God willing, trying to sign me after these two years. During Mark's final two seasons at Warner University, he batted a total of 874 with 18 home runs and 90 RBIs, setting records in the NAIA. Through those two seasons, he was projected to go number one overall, looking at teams from the Mets, Yankees, Red Sox, and Orioles, just to name a few. Earlier, we had the chance to sit down with one of the scouts from the Red Sox, Jesse Coleman. Hi, I'm Jesse Coleman. I'm a scout for the uh, Boston Red Sox, and uh, I got the pleasure to watch Mark Martinez play a couple times. He's a uh, pretty good athlete behind the plate, above average arm, you know, good blocking skills. You know, he, he has a good future ahead of him. I look forward to seeing what uh, happens to him. Uh, do you believe that after uh, his one year off that uh, he will be able to, you know, come back and play great again? Uh, maybe. He's got the talent for it. Even through the bad situation that Mark and Corey have gone through, Mark still seems optimistic to play in the majors. Through the situation, he has continued to have support from his family, friends, and former teammate. We got to sit down with one of them named Charlos earlier today. Hello, my name is Charlos. I played with Mark over 20 years. Mark is 22, and we grew up when I was five, and he mentored me, and he was a great man. He's one of the best baseball players I've ever seen in my life. It's sad to see that he has to put his career on a pause because he got a girl pregnant, but I believe because he's such a great baseball player and the guy with the craziest bat speed that he will come back after a year, after he delivers his baby with his girlfriend, Corey, that he will come back and be the best baseball player in the world. Thank you. Um, seven months along, we just had a reveal party. Um, we are having a baby boy. We're naming him Sid. Um, and we're really excited to bring him into our family. Uh, I've, been, I've been really excited to have a kid. I've wanted a kid my whole life. I didn't expect it to be this soon. Uh, I wanted to have money first, as you can see from the major, major leagues. I'd have a bunch of money. But uh, like you've seen from earlier, uh, scouts are still you know, hoping I could come back and playing well. Um, it's a dream of mine to play. And I'm really sad that I have to put it on hold for now. But like I said, my family comes first. And uh, I need to be there for them before anything else. Um, I do want to thank my friends, my family, and everyone behind me, my support system, my teammates, and the scouts for understanding the decision I have made throughout this whole entire process. Um, I promise to come back stronger than ever. And uh, my little kid, uh, Sid, he will be one of the greatest baseball players you'll ever see. He'll be better than me because I will train him up to what I want him to be. But. Uh, I'm looking forward to this experience, I'm really happy, and I hope you're happy too, the, of the decision and everything that's gone on, and uh, we want to thank E3 for also having us here today and everything, so thank you. So after a year, we spoke to Corey and Mark again. Mark has had four tryouts in the past three weeks and is doing very successful. Corey also delivered their baby boy, and he is 100% healthy and already taking swings off the tee. So that's it for this E3. Next week, tune in as we have another special edition.